A controversial church staged its grand opening last month in Nashville, and it attracted some protesters. But nobody expected what happened at the new Church of Scientology. Pushing, shoving, even arrests, and the whole thing caught on tape. Now protesters say that tape is proof they were assaulted and bullied by overzealous security guards. Channel 4's Dennis Ferrier tonight with a story you'll see only on Channel 4. Because they didn't even tell us where we could stand before they jumped me. We will call him 44, a Middle Tennessee college student who doesn't want his name out there, not after what happened at Nashville's new Church of Scientology on 8th Avenue. 44 is in a group called Anonymous. They protest Scientology events. Look what happens on April 25th as they walk up 8th Avenue looking for a place to set up their protest. As we start turning around, uh, I feel something, you know, grab me. Then all I remember is I'm on the ground, uh, you know, and I've got like three people powered on top of me. Luckily, we had cameras rolling. Um, but basically, I got tackled from behind um, while I was trying to leave. 44 was given a citation for aggravated trespassing, for refusing to leave an event and wearing a mask for intimidation. But 44 says it was the three off-duty Spring Hill security guards who assaulted him on public property, 400 yards from church property on the other side of the street. If you just watch the video, I think it's pretty clear cut. We just basically turn around and then they tackle me. You know, they give me no chance to leave my own. The Church of Scientology said they told security these are dangerous people. This group has made threats against us. They made bomb threats and death threats. So we had to take it seriously, so we hired some professional security that day. And uh, we just trusted, but, you know, trusted their judgment. So what does the Spring Hill Police Department have to say? Assistant Chief John Roberts told me it looked like the protesters were looking for trouble and found it, that the officers didn't do anything wrong, and if they did, he'd be the first to point it out, and also that the videotape does not tell the whole story. We've got a lot more coming up at 6 as well on this, Demetri. Dennis, one thing, they were wearing masks or something that made them stand out? They were wearing masks, the Guy Fawkes mask from the V for Vendetta movie, and they said take the masks off, and appears in the video they took them off immediately and followed the instructions.